groceries. We haven't even got to camp and you're misbehaving, Sam. Like, genuinely, we haven't this even- This just cannot contain my excitement. Guys, I forgot to record an intro. Oh, uh, see? Damn. What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have reached camp. You can't see anything because it's very dark. I'm still filming in the light of the car. And I will see you on the other side once we cross the bridge. We finally reached the cabin. Joy of joys. Now we just need to go in the front door. Definitely didn't almost just fall. All right, we've got some tarps down to set up our beds on. Bro. So Will has one more of these, but Will bought the mother load. One more of these. Of sour keys. And candy. They, they are like sour packages. Yeah, no, these aren't just sour keys. This looks like some kind of drug deal that's going on here. Missing his phone, and they go back in the field. So we're toasting some marshmallows. Uh, I'm gonna toast yeah. mine, I think, medium rare is what I'm going. So I've just ventured outside the cabin uh, just to say that I'm gonna see you tomorrow morning. Uh, hopefully, where we can see a lot better than what we can right now. It's it's very very dark, uh, so I can't really show you anything. Uh, but you can see stuff tomorrow morning. So see you then. Good night. Good morning, everybody. It is currently just after seven, I think, in the morning. Uh, Sam and Lucas, I think, are cooking breakfast, uh, and I've just come to the bridge to talk to you for a few minutes. Uh, it didn't really get too cold last night, but uh, tonight is actually supposed to be a little bit colder, so we're, we're making preparations for that. So basically this morning, I just got up and restarted the fire, that's about it, and then I've just filmed a few things here and there, filmed a few shots. I think Sam and Lucas are actually cooking breakfast, so that means I do not have to cook breakfast this morning unless I decide to to help them out, and I'm just, I'm just standing on the bridge right now, taking it all in this morning. So yeah, we're gonna have some breakfast, and then we'll see what happens from there. You can't really see it too well, but we have bacon and hash browns, and we got some beans cooking on the stove on the in the teal pot. The eggs, yeah. Yes, and we may or may not have forgotten the eggs. It's okay though. Coffee and breakfast, I suppose. With our pork hash, it's turned into at this point. I would like to point out that Sam and I are now eating breakfast as it lightly snows. Yeah. Like this is a true Canadian experience right here. Did you check the weather before coming to camp? Yeah. And did you say, mm-hmm, yes. It's going to be in the minuses. <laughs> not gonna lie, I don't think I did that. Mom goes, it'll be more. Mom, if you're watching this, you lied to me. Like parents often do lie. Honey, that is a really good piece of art. It's beautiful. And you're beautiful. And I love you. <laughs> there was a few lies lie. there. Good morning! We just had breakfast. And we're gonna go flag the hiking trail because there's some other people coming out to help us do some stuff with the camp, clean some stuff up. So we have to flag the trail so they know where they're going when they're moving back and forth. It is still snowing a tiny bit. I don't know, if, I'm not sure if that was just off the trees. It feels like it's snowing a little bit. But onwards, we have to go flag the trail. Everybody looks so excited, don't they? So we have successfully flagged the trail with some red flagging tape, and now we're just sitting, waiting for Scudder Dez, the caretaker here, to bring out some stuff to repair some stuff. I'm being very vague because I don't know exactly what he's bringing out. So 
Lucas and I are going to suit up in some life jackets and we have to paddle across the lake some wood and it looks like some metal as well to repair the cabin and the woodshed. Woodshed. We need a roof for the woodshed. So once we get the boat in the water, we need to tie it to the canoe? Yeah. Okay. This is going to be a cardio exercise, pulling this thing. We're going to move like one mile per hour. <laughs> So, soups and sandwiches for lunch. Right. Easy, easy enough. I guess we just have cold cuts, we're not making grilled cheese. It's not really that high tech. So, Lucas and I are going back over uh, to paddle to back to the other side because we have some garbage to pick up, and Scooter Dizzy is going to help us launch the boat in the canoe. I can show you the shed after we are finished doing our little canoeing project and I can show you some other stuff that we've just done around the camp. We cleaned up one of the cabins as well. I say we, it wasn't me. I won't take credit for that. So we made some repairs on the bridge this morning on the other side here. This was just all kind of railroad ties and that was it. You can kind of see them on the other side, but it used to be only the ties here and not any of the wood. Oh, this is pretty solid. Good job, Lucas. Yeah. Good job, Lucas and everyone else who worked on that. Let's have a look at the new woodshed with Sam inside it, but we won't, we don't discuss that fault with it. So we're just waiting for dinner now. We're gonna have sausages, mashed potatoes, and vegetables. Woo! The sausage master William is cooking. We've got our mashed potatoes, and our vegetables are about to be put on by Sam. God help us. Let's see how this goes. All right, so we've finished dinner. We've washed dishes, packed up and stuff like that. Uh, so I guess we have a little bit of time to chill. I've just been splitting wood and stuff like that after dinner uh, to have enough wood for tonight. So the stove is roaring in here. It's actually really warm. Uh, and I might just lay down and relax for a little bit while I don't have to do anything. According to my app, I've seen 1,020 movies in my Gee, what? 1,020. Get a life. Well, you suck at blowing. <laughs> That's an oxymoron. <laughs> no, you have no idea what's happening here. Exactly. What's happening here? As my candy. We didn't touch you. Wow! It took him two minutes to realize. <laughs> There's the YouTube short. Here we go. We're gonna win the Oscar, boys. We're going for the Oscar this year. All right. So we're going to watch a movie. We're we're gonna watch Monty Python: Life of Brian. I you can't see you, Will. Oh. We're gonna watch it on Will's phone. And we're just laying in bed while we do it. And Dr. Scarrick's falling asleep. Who is? All right, so you join me in the entranceway of our cabin. Uh, everybody is going to bed now. It's around quarter after nine, I think, at night right now. And all the lights are kind of getting shut off. So I'm lighting this currently with my headlamp. Um, so we watched the movie, watched Life of Brian, Monty Python, Life of Brian. And now everybody's settling down to go to bed. So I guess I'll see you tomorrow morning. Good night. Good morning everybody, welcome to Sunday morning. A bit of a chilly Sunday morning as evidenced by my toque. Um, and the sun hasn't really come through because of all the clouds that are here this morning. A bit of a shame and that would warm us up. So 
I'm really hoping for that. So everybody's woken up. Uh, there's the stove going inside the cabin, keeping us a little bit warmer than it is out here. And I slept pretty well. Uh, like I said, we went to bed at about quarter to nine. Um, I got up about quarter after one and filled the stove with some wood because the fire had basically gone out. And then Roger got up at like 5.30 because the stove had gone out again. But yeah, just pack up and breakfast this morning and then we're, we're hitting the road, we're out of here. Breakfast time. I'm gonna go get coffee. Try apples. Morning coffee. All right, so we're all packed up and now we are just walking our first load of gear and stuff out of camp. Oh boy, I think we're gonna have to make maybe two, maybe three trips this morning. Luke is just ahead of me, carrying some propane on this lovely, slightly muddy trail this morning. What is this? Oh boy. All right, well, there is a way to go around, so I'm gonna choose that option. <laughs> Ridge is a little bit slippery today, and I have to be more careful while I film this. This is definitely the most safe activity that I could be doing right now. Okay, made it. First trip across the bridge is done. So we just packed everything to the vehicles, we're all done, and now we're ready to go and drive. So I guess this means camp is done. Fall camp at Timberlake, our work weekend is completely finished. Right, Sam? Yeah. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in another video soon. And by that I mean in a few months. If you're subscribed to this channel, just unsubscribe. Like, wait, it's just a waste of your time.